Hey guys, Tolo here, and yeah, you might as you might have noticed it by now. We are playing Call of Duty Black Ops, and uh, yeah, it's a. Uh, do you know that feeling getting back to the game? Well, especially when it comes to uh, first-person shooter games, it's like your reactions, your aiming, your play style is totally bad. <laughs> and look at that nade, that is what I'm talking about. It's been a while since I played uh, a first person shooter game and especially Call of Duty Black Ops and I felt it was time to play it for a little while so here I am trying to get back into the game. Uh, my reactions used to be really really fast when it came to Call of Duty games but right now um, let's just say it's uh, the way opposite. My reactions are very slow but I hope uh, this gameplay uh, still stands out, uh, stand out as entertaining. If not, well, you'll still have my voice to uh, be there. Anyways, <laughs> Call of Duty Black Ops. A game, well, it isn't the best game, but uh, it's alright. I mean, I've tried better Call of Duty games, but uh, it's definitely still entertaining. It's, the, it's not the best Call of Duty in this genre, but uh, I like it. Uh, even though, you can still argue with the optimizations uh, within the game. It's still horrible. Um, you, you you need to do all sorts of config to get some rather good uh, game uh, performance out of this game, and that's horrible. Hopefully, my next uh, new computer is gonna work with, uh, better with Black Ops uh, compared to what I have now. But I heard uh, bad things about yeah some of the higher end uh, graphic cards not working probably with Black Ops either. But that's a good thing, because very soon we will no longer have Black Ops to entertain us. Or Modern Warfare 2 will have Call of Duty f Modern Warfare 3 to entertain us. And of course we'll have Battlefield 3 as well. And a bunch of other games. But here we are, talking about Call of Duty, and that's what we're playing. <sighs> Can't even remember what this map is called. Uh, Havana or something? I believe so. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Killing them through the wall. Dragging the pistol, killing that guy. And we got a... Chop, no not chop, attack helicopter I believe. Cobra, Cobra incoming. And uh, that turned out pretty good. <laughs> so, what is my most deadly weapon in Call of Duty you may ask? Well, it's probably need to gotta be the UAV or spy plane as it is called in... Uh, in... Uh, Black Ops. Ah, I'm not the kind of person who likes to uh, bring up the chopper gunner or the dogs or, or well, at least not the chopper gunner. Let's say keep it at that. I would rather want to be the guy on the ground who's shooting people. So I pre oh look at that, it's horrible. I still need to, a lot of practice to get at the level I was before because UAV spy plane is what promotes most of my kills. Uh, the thing that I know where people are. Uh, and uh, that uh, comes along combined with my reaction time, or at least how my reaction time used to be with Call of Duty. Uh, my weapon can be a pretty deadly weapon, I must say, but uh, right now I'm horrible. <laughs> uh, yeah. I just uh, can't wait for the next Call of Duty to come out. I need something new, something fresh to play with. And uh, some of my friends are probably gonna join me in uh, the next Call of Duty game as well, so looking forward to that can sometimes be boring to uh, play the game alone and that's uh, kind of why I stopped playing Call of Duty in the first place or at least Black Ops in the first place and for the guys who doesn't know it uh, I have been playing Call of Duty ever since the very first Call of Duty so I've played Call of Duty 1, Call of Duty 2 or Call of Duty 1, Call of Duty uh, 1 United Offensive, Call of Duty 2 Call of Duty 4, Call of Duty 5, Modern Warfare 2 and I bought uh, both uh, DLCs for Modern Warfare 2. I haven't bought the uh, DLCs for uh, Black Ops because I simply did not enjoy them. Neither did I in uh, Call of Duty, uh, Modern Warfare 2, so I'm sorry, but I did not buy them. I don't enjoy them, and I definitely don't hope they will come for Modern Warfare 3 either. But uh, we'll see about that. Oh, look at that! Horrible aiming. Horrible is horrible aiming. Aiming is horrible. <laughs> Uh, random nade. All weapons and camping allowed. I like this server. 
I see one guy on the UAV there. Somebody right here, but too bad my aiming sucks. <laughs> So, I used to do a lot of Call of Duty videos before, at least I have about, I think, about 90 videos on my uh, uh, first person shooter channel. Uh, not all of them are Call of Duty videos, but a lot of them are. Uh, it, they are on the channel called Tolo FPS, but I am no longer using that channel, as some of you guys may know. Uh, I, I did decide to merge all of my channels into one, so if I'm gonna do any first person shooter games, uh, videos in the future they are gonna be on this channel and uh, don't worry guys you, you it's your option to choose uh, in between the videos I know mo most of you guys are just here because of the uh, World of Warcraft videos but I I'm gonna do some uh, once in a while do some other videos as well such as League of Legends such as first person shooter Call of Duty Battlefield games and in the future I'm gonna do the uh, Star Wars Old Republic as well so you might as well get used to it but uh, don't worry guys I'll have the uh, name of the game in the title so you can easily click off if you don't want to watch it. Uh, yeah, But uh, the real point of this video is just to not to show any kind of skill because I'm certainly not skilled <laughs> and I'm way out of shape uh, for that matter. But uh, I just want to tell you guys I'm um, playing this game a little bit and look at that, that was the final kill of the game. I got the honor of doing so, so good game, good game. My final score ended up being 23 kills, 12 deaths with a 1.92 uh, rate kill death ratio with 4 assists. So I g hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, it would uh, mean a lot to me if you would uh, hit the thumbs up button uh, to show if you want to see more of this in the future and etc. Thanks for watching and uh, yeah, till next time. Bye!